<sighs> Why won't you turn on? <sighs> John, thank goodness you're here. I can't figure out how to turn on this video game console. Oh. Uh, well, are you sure that it's plugged in? Yeah, it's plugged in. Check. Uh, well, then all you should have to do is hit the power button. Oh, yeah, the power button. Yeah, I tried that like a hundred times. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, a lot. Huh, okay. Um, well. What is a quarter? <sighs> Brandon, you don't put quarters in a video game console. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Does it take dimes? Hello everyone, I'm Brandon. And I'm John, and welcome to the So and So Show. And why are we here, John? Because we have a show to do. Yeah, yeah but why are we doing the show? Uh, well, to have fun. Sure. And hopefully we can learn something about ourselves and each other and a God who loves us. Mm -hmm. You got questions, I got answers, Brandon. Boom! Yeah, I guess so. You guess so? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm just thinking, what about questions that we're scared to ask? Oh, uh, like what? You know, like, why do bad things... <laughs> what was that? I, I, was, I was sneezing. Oh, bless you. Yeah. Now, I was just wondering, why do bad oh. things... Uh, sorry. Are you not letting me... Ask yes. Why? No more questions. Why? Because we're the answer people, we're not the question people. Yeah, but I was just asking. No, I, I, you can't ask any hard questions that I don't have good answers to. Because, uh, no questions at all costs. Otherwise, they'll know that we don't have answers for everything. Yeah, but hey, we don't have Time answers. for us to go where no questions are asked and I can escape from reality. The great outdoors? No! Video games! Oh. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is so much better. Where are we? Ah! No questions. Come on. Right. Let's go. Okay, I'm coming. Wow. Yeah? Huh? Huh? Yeah. Oh, look, there's someone. Ah! Do you need some help? Yes, actually, I was wondering. No, 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 no questions. Let me... Either one of you. Hmm. Let's go. Look, there's another person. Hello. Hello. Want to be friends? Definitely. Okay, sometimes questions can be easy. Were there unicorns on Noah's Ark? Okay, too much! Too much! Let's keep going. Bye, friends! <sighs> Hello there! I used to be an explorer like you. Oh, I don't know if I'd call myself an explorer. I'm more of a... Are you lost? Well, now that you mentioned it, I have been feeling a little confused lately. Let's keep I... going. Oh! Hi! I have one question for you. Oh, no questions. Are you looking for a fight? A fight? No. Prepare to be destroyed. Uh, 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 I used to be an explorer like you. I'm not an explorer. Where's the end of the universe? Stop asking questions. Hello. Sorry, no time. In the book of Revelation. Uh, oh. Why do bad things happen? I don't know the answer to that! <laughs> that didn't help at all. I have so many more questions now. No, no, no. It's bottle story time with Kellen.
Fellas! You okay? Uh, no, no questions, Kellen. The show is a train wreck today. Brandon was asking some hard questions and I explained to him, we're not questions people, we're answer people. I mean, I, you know, you know, you have all the answers. Actually, I don't. <laughs> and that's okay. Brandon! I'll tell you what, this really goes hand in hand with our Bible story today. It's a video game and why don't you two play it for me? No, I'm not going in another video game. Mm -mm. Oh, no, no, no. You won't have to be in it. It's super simple, and all you have to do is answer some simple questions. Okay. Are they easy questions? Well, some of them. But if you need help, I'm right here. All right. Great. So our story today comes from the book of Acts. We read about a man named Philip, a follower of Jesus who was told to travel from the city of Jerusalem to a place called Gaza. John, now you're gonna be controlling the other character in the story, an Ethiopian official. Let's do it. Okay, so I guess that's me. Let's see here. Oh, oh yep, there's a scroll. Let's pick it up. He was led like a sheep to be killed. Just as lambs are silent while their wool is being cut off, he did not open his mouth. When he was treated badly, he was refused a fair trial. Who can say anything about his children? His life was cut off from the earth. What? That, that doesn't make any sense. I don't know about this, Kellen. Yeah. yeah, the Ethiopian official felt the same way. Now, let's go back to the game. Philip saw the Ethiopian official and said this. Do you understand what you're reading? Okay. Uh, should you A, admit you don't know and say, how can I? I need someone to explain it to me. Or B, show confidence by just pretending you know the answer. Well, I think we need to always have the answers, okay? So if you don't have an answer, faking it is probably the best way to do it, right? Uh, we're the answer people after all. You sure? I don't know. Brandon, what do you think? I think Sometimes people pretend to have confidence when they don't know something, but if you don't ask questions to what you don't know, then it's really hard to learn and grow. So maybe there's confidence in admitting what you don't know. Bingo. Let's see what happens. Okay, choosing A. That verse is talking about Jesus. Oh, wow. Yes. Philip began telling the Ethiopian official about Jesus telling him the story of how Jesus came to this world and how he gave his life for us. And if we put our trust in him, we can have a relationship with God that lasts forever. Wow, that, that's great. Yeah, that even makes me feel better. <laughs> okay, Brandon, do you wanna play the next section? Oh, okay, sure. Here you go, buddy. It's a little sweaty. All right. Uh, look, here is water. Should you A, take a drink, B, take a bath, or C, get baptized? Hmm. I mean, he was probably pretty thirsty, so I'm, I'm gonna guess take a drink? Maybe, but what just happened? Um, he just learned about Jesus. Oh, right, yeah. C, get baptized. Let's find out. Here goes nothing. What just happened? Well, we read in Acts that after the Ethiopian official was baptized, the Spirit of the Lord took right. Philip away to go preach to other people. Wild. What does that mean? I don't know exactly, and that's okay. Huh. But the Ethiopian official's life had been changed forever, and chances are he shared the story of Jesus with many more people. We read that he went on his way full of joy. The end. Oh, that's a, that's a great story, Kellen. Yeah, but get this. This all happened after Jesus left the earth, but Jesus' story was already beginning to travel all over the world. And think about it. The Ethiopian official may have never heard the story if he had been too afraid or too proud to ask questions. Very cool. No doubt. I'll see you guys next time. Later, Kellen. You know, sometimes asking questions can be scary. Yeah, but here's the thing. Even though it's hard for some of us to admit, we all have questions. Everyone? Oh yeah. In fact, reveal the question. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. what questions do you have? Yeah, maybe you have questions about the world around you, like, uh, like what is water? Yeah, and why doesn't it just break into hydrogen and oxygen atoms when you do a cannonball in the pool? Sure, and maybe you have questions about God or Jesus. I think it's important to remember that, that not knowing something is okay, and that God is with you even when you have questions. Absolutely, so stay curious, friends. Asking questions is how we learn about ourselves, about others, and about a God that loves us. Yeah, and I think I've learned today that we'll never stop asking questions. Oh yeah, there's always something new to learn. Yeah, well, I have a question right now. Ask away. Is that all the time we have for today? Yes, indeed it is, but don't worry because we'll see you next time on the So and So Show! Bye! Bye 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 bye! bye. Okay. So, questions? Can yeah. I ask you some that, oh, I've been, that have been on my fire mind? Fire away, let's, let's right. go. If we learn and improve from our mistakes, then why are we so afraid to make mistakes? Sometimes people like veggies. Mistakes are real, you know, real good, but. What came first? Orange the color or orange the fruit? Yes. Ooh, I like that answer. A lot of people aren't gonna get it, but you have to think about it a lot and then you'll get it. Yes, that's really profound. I really appreciate that. Video game. <laughs> I can't remember the, or is this something? I don't know, I think we made it up. <laughs>